Well, it looks like we need a new window. So we're gonna pull out this old paneling. This was an extension done in the house a long time ago. And it needs to be redone. As you can see, the water's coming in from the windowsill. So, it caused some damage that we have to replace. So we're gonna replace this window or have it replaced. And we're gonna replace the walls, put some insulation, and have to redo the whole wall again. What a pain in the fucking ass. Okay, so, as you can see, the water got inside the frame, and it got in not really, didn't, it didn't get inside the wall, but on the paneling. So paneling has to go, of course, well, it had to go a long time ago, but we had to save up some money first. But now it's starting to leak like that. So I stuck some ShamWow there. So ShamWow takes the water, puts it in there. This way it doesn't end up on the floor. The floor got wet. So we gotta redo this wall. The joys of owning an old house. So we're gonna take out this old paneling that's been here since the 1960s. And we're gonna replace it. So we have a guy coming in to put in a new window. He's coming in Saturday to measure it and then Sunday We'll probably put the window in. And then we have our Uncle Herb. It's going to come here and help us do the insulation. We're going to take all these panelings out. Put new insulation. Vapor barrier. And so for now we're going to put the insulation, a vapor barrier, and I think we'll hold off on the either drywall or paneling. We're not sure yet until the summertime. Save up a little bit of money because it's a big project and, well, it costs money. <laughs> Just as long as the old stuff is gone and we have insulation, it should be good. So, yeah, that's my future project or our future project on our old home.